Okay, everyone, we're back with another episode of Dawn of Titans. Okay, I'm not doing very well in this game at all. I think I've only won two battles. So I would venture to say this is a, somewhat of a very difficult game to play. Um, for me, anyway. Um, I'm sure there are people out there that uh, really know what they're doing when it comes to games of this style. Like I said, I've been out of the gaming loop for quite some time. And uh, not enough food or gold. And um, can I upgrade the castle? No. But yeah, I've been out of the gaming loop for quite some time, for many years. I've gotten married, I've had a beautiful baby girl, and I'm retired, and I'm just getting back into it. And uh, the, the gaming world has changed a lot. I mean, this is a long way away from Atari and Sega Genesis and... Uh, Arcade games at the are at the local are on your neighborhood arcade and uh, It looks like I'm getting back into it and the graphics are far uh, Better especially the gaming mechanics on some of these games um, When they used to try to display crowds of people fighting in, in games from back in the day when I was a young man. Uh, that seemed like something that was very difficult to do um, for the developers. And now, it's a walk in the park for these guys. And, uh, or it appears to be because they've got some very sophisticated software just for that. And it has obviously grown um, over the years because the crowd mechanics and the fighting in this game are, are you know, uh, even though it's at a 30 deg degree angle and not a distance, it still looks pretty good. And you got the Titans walking around getting involved. I mean, that's a lot going on in the different scenes of these games, so... Oh, I, I lost even while I was away. How about that? They raided my garrison. I can attempt to go get revenge, but it appears as though these guys have grown since the last time I was here. Uh, look at how many, um, yeah, look at how many people they got. I got hardly anyone. And, uh, to capture someone or battle someone is almost ridiculous. It appears you're going to get beat up badly. Uh, that's a lot of dudes to fight. I've tried that on my first gameplay. On the first episode, first uh, season one of this game, I tried to attack and they had just about these many and they're at level 3 and 5. I'm just at level 2. These guys are quite dangerous. Whoever this guy is, yeah, he's um, he looks like he's going to win the game. If there is even such a thing. He's, he's got a lot of dudes, man. Uh, instead of raiding and, and fighting with this guy, I might want to ally with him, right? Because here's another guy over here. Uh, he has, um, he's just a little bit ahead of me. He's at level three. I'm at level two, so I don't know. Um, I, I'm thinking this is one of those games you got to play 24-7 if you want to, uh, if you want to make any headway and 
if I look at the strength of some of these guys, wow, if I took that one piece of land from him, he's at level three and four on some of his troops, and I would, I would take a beating just trying to get that portion of land from him. But hey, everyone, this is State of the Game live stream, and we are live again, and this time we're playing Dawn of Titan. And I'm thinking, I made a mistake just volunteering to play this game, let alone a live stream. I hate embarrassing myself in the game. Especially when you have people that know what they're doing. And they are able and willing and ready to put their stuff together. And uh, we obviously all live in the clouds. Uh, you know, I can't raid this guy. But I, I, it looks like I can raid this guy. Let's see how well I do. Just for the heck of it. Um, I don't have... He's got his archers ready. I really think... Uh, I need to go for his archers. And he's got the people at his castle... So, oh, he's got a, he's got a backup troop. Wow. Um, he didn't look that powerful when I was, uh, looking at his, his little stats at level one and what have you. Um, and the question is, is he really this powerful? That's a lot of running to do, folks. Are these archers back here? No, they're not. They're swordsmen. So if I can... I don't know if he's got any... He may have some troops hiding in other places. I'm going to have to be careful with this dude, man. I'm going to hit fight. And see what happens. I'm going to drop a firebomb right here on these archers. Hopefully I got most of them. The archers are very uh, hard to deal with. And there are the other uh, guys. I took out the archers because they're not really big in battle. Looks like I'm winning this fight. Looks like. When you guys finish over here, I'm going to need you. <laughs> well, the other guys are coming back to help. Looks like we won this battle. If we're going to occupy this territory, we're going to have to take this guy out. And looks like we took out his home base. Uh, victory. I don't know how much of a victory that was. I've, this will be my third victory, but my first uh, episode of this game, I did so poorly. I did multiple on multiple battles, and I all I was doing was healing my guy's wounds like I did just now because I was mostly losing. And uh, shameful as that is to say, uh, I can't attack this guy. Now he's obviously uh, going to do whatever he needs to do to redeem himself. And uh, looks like I'm going to beat up on this poor fella again because that's all I can do trying to advance you know my gameplay um, uh, he's got troops hiding around here somewhere I th there's there's an art there's his archer so I'm gonna do this this is my strategy I'm going to attack these guys over here and then I'm going to uh, Send this group over here, over here, and over here again. And then I'm going to use the only magical weapon I have to try to take out his archers. And hopefully I've done a good job. Because I've actually, in the first episode, I played with the wor one of the worst 
Titans ever. This guy kept getting killed. And he would just fall out on the ground dead. And then my soldiers would get beat up. I, I just, you know, I, I, uh, he was the worst Titan ever. He just kept on losing. It was so upsetting. What it looks like I've, I've won, I've, I've, I've looted some food and, and other rations. Let me heal my guys up. And uh, what's happening here? What what can I do to this guy? Yeah, he's level one. I, I, I oh he's he's right there with me almost. This might be uh, a tough battle. Cause he's not too far behind me, and he's got his troops hitting off in areas that um you know let's send these guys here these guys back here and uh let's send the titan to the titan uh whoop his ass okay don't don't let that guy get away from you and then let's fight the archers, and then let's drop a bomb on them. The only magical spell bomb we have. Let's drop it on these knuckleheads as they try to elude us. I hope we got them. And they're, they're using their arrows. We're, we're getting beat up by the... The Titan was supposed to attack the Titan. What happened there? So, obviously, we didn't do too well with our strategy anyway. But this Titan is mean, man. He hasn't fallen yet. If I could take him down, we'll be saying something. Because he took out my soldiers just now. And we need to finish this guy. We've, um... Uh oh I'm losing. I am literally losing this fight. Okay, everybody kill the Titan. Oh, my Titan fell. Defeat. We didn't win this battle. This the last time this happened to me, it it, it uh like a trail of dominoes, it just continued. But it's burning over there. We we set the place on fire at least. What do you mean visit? This land is being attacked by Titan level 3. And uh, we can't attack these people. Um, what's this guy looking like? Can't raid, can't attack. What about that? Can't do any of that. Um, this right here. But I'm not able to attack him. Yeah, I better go home and uh, see how things are going at home. Cause I, I, one of my biggest concerns is when you attack people when you're away from your homeland like that. Who's to say they don't come in and just wreck the place? You know, uh, you know, uh, it's very possible. Well, at least it didn't happen, from what I can tell. Um, I was raided while I was away from the game. I had logged out of the game for a while, and while I was away, I was raided. I was literally raided. Uh, I only got 8,000 gold and 8,000 food. Uh, I can upgrade my... one of my armories if you will and I get I'm already able to create three troops out of here and four plus one so that's a total of five and my barracks let's 
Why can't we upgrade that? I don't have enough. If I look at my barracks again, yeah, it costs 11 G's in game cash to upgrade the barracks, baby. You gotta have some cash to play this game. And they stingy with the money. When I take over another territory or raid it, I should, when I loot the place, I'm not getting a lot of stuff, man. The coming winter. When Berserker Titans and the Temple now. I only got 680 red diamonds, so I don't know if I'm going to be able to win anything. And I click on this stuff, and I'm not doing very well. Uh, when it comes to upgrading the castle and other stuff, not getting a lot of um, play here. And if I go out and look for some more battles to fight, um, as you can see, one of my enemies has grown significantly. And he looks rather dangerous in the game. He does not look like somebody you want to trifle with. Uh, he's at he's at a very high level. Now here's a guy that has uh, level three troops. He's he's not too far behind me. He doesn't have a lot of people. He knows obviously how to play this game because he. If I look at his uh, his home place, oh wow! So uh, the re the retaliation for someone something like that, uh, someone like that is going to be devastating because there's not much room for quick advancement here. Um, for some reason, there are other people who really know how to play this game. Um, oh, this guy, I can, I can, I can kick his butt easy. I, I hate to do that, just jump on little people. I was little. I'm still little, and people have jumped on me, so I probably shouldn't feel so bad. Uh, does he have troops? Yeah, he has troops hiding off in the distance. And, uh, no, what are you doing? Take this guy. You take this guy. And you fight these archers, bro. What's wrong with you, man? Fight the giant dude. No, no, no. The giant dude, man, what is, why can't you do what I tell you to do? How come you can't make the Titan fight the other Titan? That's just ridiculous. Unless I'm doing something wrong here, uh, let's fight. And then we're going to drop uh, this bomb on you knuckleheads. I hope I got you, idiots. Yeah, I didn't do nothing. Yeah, we got him. And uh, we, 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 we see you. I'll take you down, buddy. Oh, boy. Oh, victory. Okay. I thought I was going to have to send the rest of my troops over there and help them because, uh, yeah. I got 6,000 gold, 5,000 food, uh, VP 22, uh, 244, experience 95. So, uh, my Titan is growing in experience. Got to heal my guys up. And, uh, nope, I'm going to not rate your game yet because it looks good for Android game. This looks really good. Um, 
and the, the the game mechanics are decent too. Um, it looks like I'm be raiding this guy. Oh, are we? Okay, I'm not uh, seeing where that's a wise move. So I'm I'm going down in troops. I'm I'm losing troops. That's weird to me. I can raid this guy, but instead of I, I was at fourteen hundred. And now I'm at nine something, so would you like to purchase this unit immediately for three gems? Do I have three gems? Yeah. The land is under attack. Turn to Kingdom View. No, I don't want to visit. I don't want to visit anybody. I want to take over. Like folks was trying to do me. Now, this guy is dangerous. Whoa. Look at this guy. He calls himself... Devil Faust. That's a horrible name to give yourself there, buddy. Uh, I strongly suggest against using that name in the future. Um, and look, I got archers now. Hey, hey, archers. This guy's got archers and he has... Okay, so I'm going to send these guys here, and then I'm going to send these guys, he's got some other troops somewhere, doesn't he? They're hiding, that's what they're doing. I'm going to send these guys here, and I'm going to send some more guys uh, here. And, uh, what is this? My, I don't know what's going on. I don't like that. That's happening. Uh, they need to go here. These guys need to go here. This guy needs to come here. Obviously, the, uh... Yeah, let's do that. And um, I guess we'll use the only spell we have. Let's fight. And uh, we don't even have any spells, dude. Dude, let them have it. These guys here. What in the world? Yeah. Use your archery weapon. I, I, I am a horrible military strategist, it appears. Because, um... We won, though. It appears as though we have. And we have. So, uh... I need enough money to, to beef up my barracks so I can... do some more damage. I, I'm a lover, not a fighter, man. I, I need to... You see that young man right there? He, he's got plenty of concubines at the castle there. I, I think he ought to stick to procreating and live, live a peaceful life if he can in his kingdom. Unless some maniac comes along like Devil Faust and tries to ruin it for him. But 
this this war stuff I just assume leave this to the maniacs and uh, shields are removed when attacking another kingdom what kind of shields are removed why would you remove my shields that's just not cool uh, anyway I'm gonna go ahead and fight this guy hopefully I can take him down um, he seems rather weak and this is a game where you prey on the weak and uh, what are you doing man yeah let them guys have it and uh, let's fight okay let's get this whole group right here to shoot arrows at that bunch I don't know why they held back, but, uh... Yeah. He's got troops in the background there. I can see him. They haven't really moved yet, did they? Well, we're winning. That's important. And it looks like we've won. So, uh, should I switch Titans? How would someone like to, um, depending on how many comments I see in the comment section, I'll switch Titans because they need a chance to grow their skill levels too. This young man is, uh, obviously built for war. He's been fighting the, even some of my losing battles on the last uh, the first episode of this game so um, I'm gonna oh hey wait a minute I just yeah do I raid this no no do not raid that guy what about this guy is he a chump we raiding chumps right now because we're at chump level and we're trying to get out of that. And we don't want to be seen as chump. Uh-oh. There's that guy again. Stay away from Devil Frost. He's about half crazy. Yeah, I can tell. He's, he's a real nut. It's not a lot of people to take out in this game. And, and, and gain superior notoriety in power if I go back to my castle checking on things this is the titans I've collected I've got five titans and uh, Artemisia is my uh, titan guru she gives me a report and she calls me her liege welcome to the titan pantheon this is roman crap during the days of Rome. Uh, I got five Titans. And this is the baddest one I got. This dude right here. Kobar. Kobar is mean with it, man. Kobar will knock your head clean off your shoulders. And... Uh, I've already earned this Titan. What do you mean, chance to earn? This is another Titan I have. Dralek. Dralek is a horrible fighter. Uh, he's a level 1 Titan, and he sucks, man. I don't know why. Because Dralek seems like uh, he would crack open some skulls, too, but... Um, that's the guy I was telling you about. He would fall in battle almost immediately.
Okay, Drellic is such a bad Titan. Um, I lost so many battles with him in the first episode. I wanted to tell him, look, man, just take your bind over there and sit down by them trees somewhere. Don't, don't do nothing else. He embarrassed me and my guys so bad, I just wanted to tell him to do that. And it appears, though, I've got people waiting for me to leave the area and they come and raid my garrison while I'm not there. And, um, <clears throat> this was nine minutes ago. Excuse me, and one was nine, uh, 13 hours ago. If I go and look and see who that is, this guy is at 8,000 defense. He's spent some money on this game. That's what he's... When players advance so quickly like that, I think they spend money on the game to give themselves an edge over the other players. And I guess they do enough research to know what to do. And they're probably used to playing games of this style or what have you. And uh, obviously, I'm not... Okay. Uh, less than a minute ago, uh, I defended a garrison and won. So, but 10 minutes ago, I lost one. Again, this guy is at 4,000 defense. I wouldn't be able to beat him, even if I tried to get revenge. But if I picked one of the areas, even his... Even his um, lands that he's raided. It's a pretty tough dude, man. Okay. Uh, wow. It looks like it's only going to be a few major players in this game. And if you're left out, um, you're going to have hell to pay. Because uh, a lot of these guys are beefing their little stuff up really fast. And... Um, Whatever lands you think you're taking, they're gobbling them right up, as I can see. <coughs> Excuse me. From what I can see. And uh, here, this guy has just been attacked. He's level 9. And he's currently under attack. So, um... No, oh, I wouldn't be able to beat this guy. I just wouldn't be able to do it. Now, he's pretty fortified, man. This is ridiculous. Look at the power some of these guys have gotten already. Can you start a new game and just start over and get out of this world? This guy is at 1800. If I try to attack him, he's higher than me. Uh, I need to change my type now. That's what I need to do. Um, I need to get rid of this guy. He's... He's... Um, which one of my titans can... Um, can Kobar do it? Is he able? He's at 1,500. He can go in here and whoop this guy's head, I think. I'm not really sure, but um, I don't know. This looks pretty risky. This is one of those risque games. You get off on the wrong foot, buddy. You're going to get got. Hey, I can get this guy, right? Oh, no. Look at that. Uh, that's a bluff right there. You can get off in there if you want. Um, I don't want, I'm not ready to take that kind of risk. I'm looking around. I'm seeing some pretty powerful cats. 
and uh, oh snap so yeah um, for a few dollars in this game you can beef your game up step it up a little bit and stop the uh, the madness so to speak I don't know um, I got a level 4 garrison for my castle and um, what I need to focus on is my armory and I need gold man I need gold and I need spearmen I, I need to upgrade these guys and get them in the game um, yeah if I go back to my barracks, I need, yeah, let's, Oh, that was a mistake. Why did you do that, man? I I don't know what I'm doing right now. Am I doing this right? I do some more archers. Okay, um, I've spent some of my little stuff, and I can enter the, oh, I'm not seeming to, hmm. Excuse me. I'm really trying to beef up my gameplay here for you guys. And I I I, I wanna uh I wanna um do it right, but uh what the heck happened here? One minute ago my garrison was raided by some tough guy. Uh Somebody who thinks he's tough. Can I can I raid anything belonging to this fool? Um, shields are removed when you're attacking the kingdom. Let's try that. Let's just give it a shot. See what happens. I got my guys out here. And uh, does he have anybody hiding behind the bushes anywhere? But I am going to... Uh, let's take back what you stole from me, buddy. Well, it is apparent that um, we are winning this fight. And um, we're doing a pretty thorough job of it. So no, it. I was afraid of how powerful someone is. It looks like that makes no difference. Um, if they have a territory that's you can you can take them down or take back what they stole from you, revenge wise. That's a good thing, right? So, this is the land of Haas. I have gotten my revenge 
and I got a territory. But, uh, Um, it looks like I'm going to have to live within my means here and fight guys on my level. Oh, this guy's got troops, man. Look at this. This dude is ready for battle. Do it. Let's do it. Oh, he's he's got his archers doing their thing, man. All right, we're overpowering them. Let's continue on. Looks like we got them. Looks like it anyway. I'm in level three. Heal my guys, come back home. Can I capture? What? What do you want me to do? Search. Join an alliance to truly partake in the battle and glory of the kingdom. Which alliance should I join? I'll join that one just because you said so. Let's see how well that works out for us. Because alliances have requirements too, you know. Everybody appears to live in the clouds. With moving land masses. Well done, my liege. You are now part of a greater group of kingdom. An alliance. All right. Uh... Thank you for that. Now, what do you want me to do now? This is your alliance overview. Keep track of your progress here. Alrighty. League. Earn VP to elevate your alliance to higher leagues. Higher the league, the better the rewards. The Silver League. Leaderboard. Band with your alliance to take down other kingdoms and become the divine ruler. All right, now that sounds like a plan. Uh, yeah, it really does. But how do you do that? Okay, you can also communicate and plan attacks with your alliance in chat. Sounds good. Well, there's the chat. I can chat with my alliance. That's the alliance button. I can say stuff. Alright, but I don't want to say anything right now. So let's not do that. Uh, let's go back home. Alright, and yeah. My liege, by joining an alliance, you have unlocked the alliance camp. Oh, really? Uh, let's upgrade that. Make a request. I need reinforcements. Yes, I do. And I can upgrade. Skip for free. 
new level for my alliance camp. And what do we have here? Uh, builder's yard. I don't, I don't, uh, don't um, know what that is yet. Yeah, I don't want to mess around in there. Let's go back. What the heck? If I battle this guy, take it easy, Tovar. We don't do something with it. Uh, just slow your roll there, big dog. Don't make me switch you out, man, with a kind of bad attitude. <laughs> I'm gonna have to switch Kovar out. He's so hungry for battle. Um, it's a shame. I, 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 I need to get him to chill, man. Kovar, I want you to take. Oh. This dude is at a higher level than you, man. No, let's take his little deal over right here. Let's take that. Here we are, still picking on the little guy because I'm a little guy and the, and the big guys are picking on me. So I gotta, <laughs> isn't that horrible? You gotta return the favor by going and picking on somebody littler than you. I think they call that being a bully. Alrighty. Let the battle begin. I clearly have an advantage. Let's zoom in a little bit. Yeah, we're ready. Hopefully it'll go just that way. The next time I visit this guy, I want to take that territory from him so I can have two territories. Everybody. Okay, let's raid him again. Cobar to count to six. And watch what he do. <laughs> Excuse me, Cobar, I look at you. Say, Cobar, count to six. Uh, six. What? How did you, where did you start from to get to six, Cobar? 
Get out! Leave me alone! Yeah, Cobart is, uh... Cobart is, uh... Not too bright a fellow. But just don't get in the fight with Kobar because Kobar will get you. And he may not be able to count too well or read very well, but he will beat you up in the fight. Yeah, Cobar has very bad reading and writing skills. And as his commander in chief, I promise I'd get him uh, get him taken care of in that regards. And uh, once we uh, are able, first we gotta make some money, bruh. This is a hard game. Bar, thank you for all your loyal service, bro. Um, I'm going to get you some literary training in a little while. Um, but continue to fight on my side. Am I going to just continue to keep fighting this dude? Uh, I'm concerned about that. Let me check something. If I go home to my armory and I enter it, I don't have a lot of stuff here, buddy. <laughs> Excuse me. I do not have a lot of resources here, and I just went into battle three times with this fella. I, I don't like that. Let's go into barracks and uh, see what's happening. I'm level 26 on my militia. I'm at maximum capacity, y'all, so. Can I change that? Let me 
any form of fashion? Evidently not. Um, not good. I only got 180. That's not a lot of gold, bro. What is happening with my kingdom? Why aren't they making money, dude? Can we upgrade the castle at all? Nope. No castle upgrades. Just sitting ducks, it seems like. If I enter the Hall of Titans, oh, in another hour or so, I guess I'll, if I can change it, yeah, yeah, sure, man. What do I get? Because I'm just beating up on this dude, and I'm not getting anything for it. It's like I'm spending money, and I can't take the kingdom because... We appear to be evenly matched almost, and I don't want to run the risk of losing my people. Barracks. Let's do that. Alright, we built another barracks, it appears. It's under construction. And, uh. Let's do a gold mine. Your builders are busy constructing barracks. Okay. Let's skip that. Yeah, let, let's let them do that. And then we'll go out here and see if we can beat up on somebody else. If we can even do that. Because this guy is 1,040. And I'm outnumbered by this dude. I don't like those odds. Um, there are kingdoms built in the rocks. Whoa! What's the attack over here, man? Uh... These appear to be ruins, and also appears to be um, event reward. Um, alliance rank, 16,000. I don't know, let's give it a try. What do we have to lose? Uh, what are my rewards? Uh, all of this stuff, if I can beat this creature. Uh, what, did, what just happened? I was just there. And, uh... We were going to fight this creature. And then something bad happened. We... We left. This is where I was. And, uh... Yeah. No recent attacks. I'm pretty sure why. Uh, I'm pretty sure as to the reason why. Anyway, uh, that that place doesn't look too. Um, and what's that? Defense twenty six thousand. So this is obviously being guarded by something or someone. 12,000. I can't uh, make an attack or make an attempt to attack out of my range. What did I click on the last time I got the opportunity to, uh, obviously I'm not going to win this fight. Because they're, they're letting me know you're making a mistake. You are not ready, son. Oh, this, this guy. Whoa, somebody lives here. Yeah, uh, y'all, y'all, hey, peace. Y'all be good.
I'm gonna roll out now, me and my crew. We not gonna mess with you guys. Um, claim. I claimed some land. Wow. That was surprising. Uh, I even made some money in doing so. So I can defend it. Yeah, 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 let him do it. Yeah, he's got enough battle experience to do that. Um, Astrid. This guy's got some battle experience too. I'm gonna select him to the team. That. And uh, this. Yeah, let him become my land. Oh, this is my land. I got two territories now. Cool, bro. Cool. <laughs> I can call him some more land. Look at that. I have three territories now, and I can defend it with uh, this guy. Dralic is untrustworthy. I, I don't really think he's ready to. Halstead is already defending your castle. Allow Dralic to replay. Okay. Dralic is, is strikes me as uh, retarded, man. Um, he doesn't really have what it takes to uh, do any of this of the hard stuff. I got one more land I can claim. And then I'm going to have to go to my temple and summon another... Uh, oh, I've already done that, it appears. I've got four territories. I don't have to defend it. Yeah, I should. Farms of Dunan, level four. So I've got four territories. Okay, what's this? I don't want to do any raids just yet. Um, I need to use this to my advantage if I can manage to do that. Look at all of this, man. This game has grown quickly. Where's my uh, territory at, buddy? Way back over here. Okay. So there was land available to claim. I don't know how valuable it is in me doing that. Um, but wherever I am in the mix, there I am. I've got four territories and I need to beef them up. Um, I've got people defending my land. I really don't know how I got stuck with Dralic, man. That guy is retarded, dude. Dralic, do something. Do what? <laughs> Okay, 15 hours. More info. Okay. Alliance War. The coming winter. 95% off. $4.99. I get the starter bundle. 
Alliance in this pack, Hercules, Belt of Vigor, Builder's Yard, 10k food pack. Okay, I'm going to take this. I'm going to go ahead and do this one. Uh, at least I think I am. Uh, purchase cancel, okay? Let me see what I'm missing. I can get 2,000 gems for five bucks. I really don't want to do this anymore. Oh, this is regularly $49.99. Well, you, you know the sales game. People, you know how they try to hustle us, just like they do at the, uh, the car dealerships. Um, half off. This car has been marked down significantly. No, it hasn't. Just trying to hustle us, man. You just trying to hustle us, bro. Okay. Okay, don't say I never did nothing for you. Okay, Mr. Video Game. Right, tell me what it contains. The gems and the portal stones contained in the starter bundle have already been added to your supply. Great. I didn't get any gold. I got 3,700 gems though. No spells. For 49 bucks, you ought to regular price. You ought to get some gold. And uh, some spells. Your new relics will be stored in the relic inventory. Oh, this is the relic inventory. Gotcha. If your inventory is over full, additional relics appear in the treasure room. This is the treasure room. Got it. Okay. You can also construct an extra builder's yard. Let's do that now. Alright. Let's construct an extra builder's yard. Where would I do that? Here? The starter bundle contains a kingdom shield which will protect your lands. To activate this, upgrade your castle to level 3. Or what is my castle at now? Finally, you now have a titan token. Visit the temple to use this and claim a new titan. Good. Because I want to sell Drellix as that, that boy is retarded, man. Is my castle at level four? Oh, so I don't. I, I can go to the temple. Where is the Titan's Pantheon enter? Is this the temple? No, that's not the temple. I'm gonna let that work itself out. I need to get to the temple. Is this it? Where is the temple? At 200 gold, I get to build a gold mine. Let's do that. Because I'm going to need to mine gold. I, it's obvious not, obviously not coming to me as a king of a big kingdom should be getting gold. Uh, this must be the temple. This is a portal. What is this? This is portal stones that allow you to enter battle. Okay. Expand the city. Why can't I expand the city? Oh, this is under construction. I can freely finish that. The garrison has been upgraded. Expand the city.
Upgrade the garrison to increase the amount of units you can place on your kingdom's defense. Alright. And it cost me 24 gold to finish the garrison. How long will it take to finish it? Ah, uh, what the hell. Upgrade it again? No. Um, where's this temple? So I can, uh... Visit the Adventures Guild to take part in brand new campaigns. This is going to be a good game. Whether you see a statue on the guild's tower, new campaigns are available. Wow. Well, can I enter this world, man? That's the Adventures Guild. Look at my kingdom. You just call me King Daddy. That's right. All who oppose King Daddy will get a, a whooping. Uh, what is happening here? Can I sell Drellic? I mean, uh, you know, Drellic is retarded to me, man. He, he's not too bright. Yeah. <laughs> Who is this? Oh, twelve thousand. Okay. You have bigger titans. Gold mine built. Uh, let's go back home and see that. My gold mine is built. I want to get that Adventures Guild going, man. That sounds interesting. I got another barracks. I've got. Uh, an armory. Can I build another armory? I don't have 7,500 gold, bro. Um, well. gonna let me build another armory. It is not spell forage. Gold storage. Let's go ahead and build that. Okay. Food storage. Let's build that. that much uh, right now I just need to get going um, farming so I can have food for my people the builders are building are busy constructing gold storage okay and they're busy so do I go out here and uh, beat up some people raid enemy I've done that. Um, I don't see where... Uh, if I go to my castle and I upgrade gold mines... Uh, not able to use that menu correctly. Uh, no recent attacks. Uh, I can go out here. People are you said I can go in the, the temple and uh, increase land capacity by one. All right, I've done that. Let's 
go home and let's go back to the temple. Where can I summon another Titan? Titan Pathion. Fan City Garrison Portal Upgrade Requirements Castle Level 8 This is There's the temple. Let's enter the temple and let's get a uh, okay. Let's get ourselves a uh, Titan. We want another Titan. I'm not giving you thirteen dollars for nothing. Temple. Enter. Uh, resources. I got portal stones. I don't know why I did that, but uh, when I enter the temple. I can't see how to win Berserker Titans in the temple now. Uh, let's go to, no, let's go back again. No. Let's, um, there's no back button. You literally gotta come out and go back in. I thought they said I can go in the temple and get a Titan. There it is, get Titans. Uh, I don't know, buddy. I don't have that much gems. At all. I got 1,000 gems. Epic Relic. I don't want an Epic Relic. I want a Titan. For 2,000 gems. Oh no, that's uh, too much. Shivering altar. I don't want that. I might want to leave this alone for right now. Okay, what is this? Building and upgrading gold storage increases the maximum amount of gold you can hold. Uh, I'm gonna upgrade it. I'm gonna do this. And, uh, yeah. And, uh, upgrading it again. And, uh, just like in life, it takes money to survive. So we have extensive, uh, gold uh, mine with storage capability. Ow. Now, we also have a food setup, now we can upgrade that. Let's upgrade it again. There we go, we can get a lot of food together for the, for the guys, all the people. We don't want to leave them stuck out have to deal with not having food like we've done in the past
Alrighty. After looking around my kingdom, I'm uh, thinking I should uh, see what I can do with my armory. And I don't. I'm trying to upgrade my armory to level 4, dum dum. Oh well. It appears as though I have two barracks. I think that was a good move. I really do. But now I have I have two barracks so I can go to the second barrack and I can add uh, archers, troops and spearmen. I think. Yeah, no. Says I'm at capacity. Okay. Uh, I come over here to this barracks. That one's not upgrading. This one is. Okay. Okay. I really don't see where I'm doing what I'm supposed to do. It seems to be rejecting me. Um, so if I can hold off for an hour, that's my temple. I can go back in here, I'm assuming, and request another Titan. The relic is beyond stupid. He just won't fight. He, he'll go out into the middle of a battlefield and just pass out. Why are you passing out, Dralic? Uh, uh, uh. You see them trees over there, Dralic? Go over there and sit down. Don't you come out from over there until I call you. It's your stupid self. Okay, buddy. I got you. I got you. I got you. Well, uh, we have another slot. Flame volley. Belt of vigor. Uh, something harvest. And frost globe. Well, I don't know what that is. And we have how then And of course we have Ninian Pelt and Dragon Helm. What is all of this mess? Goliath Belt. Let's try that. Ford Deck with the Holy Guard. What did we get? Okay, did we get something worth level one of five? But 
I, I want to produce a, a, a Imperials treasure room. Collect. Can't collect. Make sure you have enough space for extra troops. Okay? Okay. Uh, yeah. That's not good. Because. Listen, Cobra, I need you to calm down, buddy. You don't rush me. I'll sick my archers and my spearmen on your big behind. Now you just stand there until I call you. Free summon. Um, not right now. I'm busy. Let's lend the Lightbringer game. We were playing that earlier. Uh, guys, I I like that game. Um, I'm expecting great things about that game. Now, if we click on Flame Volley and uh, the Harrow or the uh, Halberd, look at that. Let's go ahead and force that. You are about to sacrifice a rare relic. Do you want to continue? Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to spend 36 gems, bro. Mm. Okay. Belt of Vigor. Along with the Bountiful Harvest. No. Select that. Come up the flame holly. Wow. And the harrow. No. Let's get rid of that. The harrow doesn't seem to. What about the matter? No. Oh, wow, that's a big one. I'll, uh. Not enough food and storage. Well, we'll do this. Okay. Whatever that is. Relic ability improved. 21 cent percent titan damage okay if you add the goliath belt to that um, i think we're pushing it let's get out of here okay let's put it right there where's what i created at where is that at this guy Okay, let's uh, apply that. Let's forge it. We, we don't have to forge it anymore. We've done it. And this is... I told you, Kobar, if you don't calm down, I'm going to get at you, bro. You better calm down, man. Make me say it. All right, that's it. That's it. You don't punish me, dude. But you asked me for nothing for two days with your big retarded self. 
keep stumping your little spirit me. Y'all see that? Kobar really has a has a has a bad attitude. Kopar gets really impatient. I don't like that. I'm the king around these parts. I'm Mustafa. You hear me, Kobar? You remember that. I don't know what Kovar is up to, but he really needs to calm himself. What is this? Castle level 4, upgrade to level 5. And uh, yeah, let's do that. I got 19,000 gold. I got zero food. That's not good. What does this do? Um, can we build another farm? Yes. Let's do that. And let's upgrade it. Can we upgrade it? Let's upgrade it. Okay. The harvest deal. Where's the harvest deal, bro? I, I don't understand this. Where's the harvest deal? That seems appropriate to forge for the farming, right? We got two farms. So food should no longer be an issue. The Harold. Let's forge that with bountiful harvest. Look at what happened there. They didn't do nothing. And let's do the Matic with it and the other Matic. Uh, what about the Goliath belt? Wow! And the other Harold. No, that, that's. <laughs> I think we're going a little too far. Let's forge that. Yeah, whatever, bro. I'll, I'll take that. It appears as though we're casting spells to improve our, our food harvest. Uh, that's a bit weird to me, but it. 2400 out of 3200 or something like that. 12% food production. That's an improvement uh, ability. That's not bad. So, uh, looks like we did pretty good with that. Um, and let's collect that. Oh, there's the... Uh, what you call it? Thing. Um, okay. You again. Not right now, young man. You really ticked me off earlier. Ten K gold sack with Matic. Oh no, I, I'm not buying that, buddy. I, I got fourteen hundred thousand gold. 
I'm good right now. I need to, uh, what is this? I got 11,000 gold left. I need to chill, man. I need to get out here and, uh, no, I need to get out here and attack some, some people. <gasps> This dude. Let me raid this dude right quick. Look, I, I'm not ready. Oh, I'm at 2200. I, I think I can take this guy. I think I can. I think I can. Said the ch -ch train. But this dude hiding behind the bushes. Because he doesn't have. Does he have, uh, does he have archers? I'm going to let the computer, uh, work this battle. I don't know what to do about this. Uh, we have a clear advantage. And I think we can take it. I want to know that we can. He doesn't appear to have any archers. Now, he's coming around us, trying to flank us. Look at him, coming out the bushes and stuff. These guys have it, man. They, they really. Victory. A thousand food, a thousand pounds. Kobar's crazy ass. He loves this shit. He gets a real kick out of running into battles. He doesn't even care if he's going to win. He just likes to fight. As soon as he gets the opportunity, he wants to fight and beat something up. Kobar's crazy like that, people. Look at him. This guy looks like he could swallow 12 pounds of chicken and steak in one city. I told you about doing that, big fella. You really need to calm yourself, boy. Let's take this to the corner, man. All I can do is raid this camp. I can't take it over. How do you take over something? Okay, let's give it another go around. And, uh... Alright, these guys are gonna try to flank us. I think I saw arrows. And... No, 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 that's not what that is. Here they come. I stuck them down the thing. I'm going 
give you a break after this program. I think you are uh, Good. My rank goes down. That's a good thing. Well, why am I? What? Again? Are we going to have to keep doing this? When do we take this? Yeah, why doesn't this stuff decrease like mine did? After all those losses I experienced. I lost so much rank and, and resources, it was pathetic on my first episode of this game. It was, it was embarrassing. Here they come again. See this guy? Here they do this. Uh, focus fire. Look at him coming. Let him have it. Shoot the arrow. Oh, we we won without that. We're back up to fifteen thousand in gold and four thousand in food. It's becoming pretty lucrative to uh, defeat this guy. Well, I guess we'll just keep raising this little stuff. Let's let you guys do your thing. I guess we'll keep fighting this guy until we make some headway and then we see the word capture or something like that and we'll take him down that way. I thought this would, would be a lot easier. A minute here I'm going to trade Cobalt out and let him defend the castle. I, might, I think I'll do it right after this battle and put Dralix are crazy behind out here and, and let him get some fighting experience. Dralix is not too bright. I, I, I can't stress that enough. Yeah, Dralix is not playing with a full deck at all, man. Yes, this will be the battle where we switch our Wadralic and uh, hopefully we can make some headway with Dralic because he's just, um, he is stupid as they come. Okay, uh, castle level one. Raid again. Titan. I'll switch you out with Dralix crazy ass. There he is. And we'll 
say okay to that. And uh, let's see, look at him. Now see, Drellick look like he got plenty of sense, but he doesn't. He just doesn't. And sitting and talking with Drellick is no prize either because you could be right in the middle of a conversation with Drellick. You know, <laughs> he'll say something like soup. <laughs> what do you mean, soup, Drellick? I want to. <laughs> Drowick needs to go with experience. We got to keep this guy on a short leash. He's just not too bright. We let him get out too far, and uh, we can lose it. <laughs> Cobar is no prize either because he can't read or count. Like I told you before, when you tell Cobar to count to six, you start with the number six. Many of my soldiers have explained to Cobar, uh, look at this. Many of my soldiers have tried to explain the final points of counting from one to six with, with um, Cobar. And to no avail, they have, uh, they have failed significantly. And uh, it's, it's not a big loss. But, uh, you know, we, we're making it work. I mean, Cobar can't count to save his life, but he can fight. Man, that kid can, that guy can fight. Um, believe it or not, in giant years, he's only three. And in human years, that's 3,000 years old. And uh, he's still a baby. Uh, considered, I mean, you know, because by most standards he's just a baby and um, Dralic here is, is seven that's seven thousand years old in giant years but um, if we can take him to see the wizard and grow some sense Dralic might become useful And yes, Cobar is very impulsive. He's impatient. He doesn't like to wait. He's very impulsive as a result. He's got into many hairy situations and we had to come bail him out. I can tell you some stories about 
stupid ass Cobar and, and, and uh, Drowick. Between the two, Drowick is the stupidest. But uh, right now we got Drowick in training. He's learning how to fight. Cobar knows how to fight. Don't have to worry about him. But you think I'd get more out of doing these little short battles and winning here, but I'm not getting anything. As I zoom in here. Some of the battle we won again. This is about five, six victories in a row. I wasn't counting, but that's what it feels like. I might be right. And here we are uh, giving Dralic some, some fighting experience. At least trying to, anyway. I think we should keep going. Just allow old Dralic here to to become more useful. And hopefully we'll go ahead and get another uh, another uh, Titan here. Because Dralic's uh, fighting experience came in very low now that I think about it is the reason why he took a beating every time we went into battle and we had to make him go sit down over by the trees and wait till the battle was over and uh yeah Jalik does have a good sense of humor, though. He... He's got jokes. He makes... He makes... He's good for the morale of the uh, soldiers. He gets everybody laughing. And, uh... We all told him he should become a stand-up comedian. Instead of trying to be a warrior of sorts because he's not very good at it. He seems to be determined. short of a six pack. He's fought many of battles and he's lost many of battles. Uh, we raised him from a pup though. And I mean that in giant years. He eats a lot too. And we wonder where it all goes. He doesn't gain weight like Cobar. Cobar and the other uh, Titans are always trying to watch their weight. And getting a lot of exercise. But not Drellick. He, he eats to his heart content. And... Uh,
get that experience. You know, no magic, though. I'm about ready to call this quits, guys. We're just fighting for the heck of it. If I can get Drellic up to 500 and something in battle points, he'll be right there with Kobar and the rest of them. At least Drellic can count to six, though. Um, you know, the Giants like to tease Drellick and Kobar, you know, and because of Drellick's uh, fighting skills and Kobar's intellect, um, if you ask me, they should fight together because. Drellick can count the soldiers that Kobar kills and uh, Kobar can fight while Drellick watches because you know well I, I, I guess I can leave Drellick alone for a while because he's getting some battle experience and that's important to have some battle experience. If you don't have battle experience, what are you doing? What are you doing on the battlefield? Ain't that right, fellas? Look at that. We are victorious once again. It doesn't seem like it's going to take much to get Drellick up to speed as far as battle, doing battle. But uh, I'm really trying to get more of these locks, these spaces unlocked so I can get more soldiers on the field. But it doesn't look like I'm doing anything to this guy. What is this, just a skirmish or something, man? on this game is great, man. When it comes to these video games, I'm a big fan of graphics and strategy and gameplay. I like build games, I like race games. I like deep space uh, simulation games. Especially when you can build and fight. I like upgrading my ships piece by piece. I like upgrading, you know, being able to land on planets and do all kind of stuff. That's great. But, uh, 
I, I just I'm, I'm waiting for a sh good strategy game to just bring everything together in one place like uh, Cyberpunk 2077 now that's a futuristic game that's on the highly anticipated uh, side of things I, I can't wait to see it uh, hopefully we'll have a computer by then um, I mean not just a normal computer, I'm talking about a really decent computer that'll allow um, for some really good gameplay and graphics and gameplay. And at the same time, I can get some work done, you know. I like doing graphic arts and design on different, on different levels and all that good stuff. Alright, let's do one more battle and then we'll give... Uh, Mr. Dralic here a uh, break uh, because he's um, it look like he's chewing on something right now. I'm telling you that boy like to eat and it ain't gum. He's always eating on something. I bet you got a turkey leg stashed off in his his uh, his uh, armor there somewhere. Give the guy a break. Heal everybody. Continue. Let's uh, let's move around and see if we can claim some more free territory. I'd like to do that. Wow! Look at this. These guys are really packed in here. Their kingdoms are immaculate. But, uh, let's not do anything stupid. Let's just, I mean, stupid as far as trying to challenge somebody like this. And other areas and territories we've seen. for free territory that we can just claim and say it's ours not just another pile of rocks something we can say this is mine okay. um, an open world game on your phone how about that people Looks like we went to the end of the the world where we are. Uh, we are limited at certain distances. And it's apparent that we're constantly in the sky. Okay. We can't just keep going willy-nilly. You gotta stop at some point and uh excuse me I'm traveling along the outskirts of this existence. 
so it's not a complete open world it's to a point uh, but it, it, it is still pretty good for what we're able to do on the phone on a phone so if anybody anybody can afford to go out and buy that new iPhone R, uh, 10R or uh, the one just below that, the 10S or whatever they call it. But uh, and of course, most people have the Android, like I do, and uh, you got some really powerful features on these phones. The processors uh, on the micro scale are much better than they used to be, and. Uh, Why are you even suggesting that I try to capture someone with 4,000 power and strength? And I've only got 1,000. This guy's got 26,000 power and strength. So, uh, evidently they couldn't wait to spend some money on this game. Look at this guy. Wow. I do I still don't know how you take a territory. How do you just claim a territory and take it? Um, and it's not a lot out here. They really need to beef this up. Cause I came to this particular spot before and uh, and it lit up. It, it gave me some feedback as far as information as to what resides here. And there's a creature that resides here. I think it's just up to you to be powerful enough to take him out. And um, I've gathered the resources here. Oh, I can claim this one. I'll take that. Fireball. So I have five territories now. I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm. A, hey, look! I got Hercules. Let's let him defend it. Uh, and of course, the giant blade. with that yeah yeah um oh no we can't allow we can't allow that and then we come here and nine hundred percent false souls Hang on a second here. And I bagged out a bit. But if I come back here and hit defend, Hercules shows up again. Now, uh... Yeah, let's just go ahead and let him defend that. Say defend. And then hopefully he's good. Lootable. Uh, yeah. Hercules, Hercules! Uh, this land is not defended. Defend to generate. Well, how do I defend it, bro? If there's nothing there to defend. Somebody can easily take that land from me. And I have... I can't enter it. 
I can enter it, but uh, I have the gold and stuff that I can collect. I have to get another uh, Titan in order to defend my territory properly. Um, I've literally found five pieces of land that I've claimed. And my power is at 5,000 now, so I can attack somebody that's 4,000. At least that's what I'm thinking. How about we go to my house? This is Haas's house. And um, if I click on this one, and this increase line capacity by 200. Did that? I should take it easy. I'm spinning up my little gems. Okay, what's going on here? Got 14 hours left on that. Go over here to the temple, and uh, that's not what I push. This is what I push. I go in here, and can I? Return once the timer reaches to zero to open the daily bonus for free. Yeah. Every time I come home, I start spending money. That's not good. Resources. Um, portal stones. Wow. Portal stones. I get 50. It costs 300. Um, what is Divine Shrine, right? Yeah, get Titans. You need 2,000 for that one, 24,000 for the other. Daily Titan chance for. 2000. I don't have the the means for that anymore. And if I click here, I have raid enemies. And nothing like some enemy lands raided 0 of 1. Why would I do that? is not ready for this guy at all um, he's just not I can see it in his face Drelic is just not ready um, he might be able to do this one let's see what happens let's go into battle and um, see if we can take this guy um, let's see, he's got archers. He's got two sets of archers. So we are, are lacking on this. We might lose this. Let me try it just to see what happens. But I haven't captured anything from anybody yet. Shoot back, man. Shoot arrows back. I don't want to get excited too quickly because uh, we won. Now, did we actually capture the territory like they said? Let's, let's see. Okay. 
Okay. Let's see what we did here. So that's three, six. We did. We captured it. So, uh, so we've done one. Uh, rated enemy. Uh, lens rated. Yeah. I don't know, folks. Let's uh, let's take it easy here. We get too excited and get disappointed. Now, now, Growlit, don't be stupid. You have uh, disappointed a lot of people over the years. I don't even have enough, um, uh, what do you call it, uh, titans to protect my territory. This is my allied area, and I can easily come over here to enemy territory and uh, raid somebody's camp. This guy has 34,000 defense. That's just retarded, buddy. You can't take this guy. Um, here we have another territory. 10,000 power, uh, whatever. I guess that is supposed to scare you, and rightfully so. If you are scooting around like I'm doing right now, looking to see what you can get from somebody. That could be, hey, this is doable. Right, because I'm 5,000. And, uh... Okay, uh, Dralic is not ready for this guy. And I'm not gonna... embarrass him or my kingdom any further. Because if I know Dralic, and I do pretty well, He's not too bright. He can't handle uh, running up and raiding somebody's stuff, let alone trying to capture it. So, um, looks like we're all out of ideas here. Look at that. 24,000. These guys are spending big dollars on this game, man. They really are. Okay. Let's see if I can take him. He's 2,500. I don't know. Uh, this is not a very good advantage. Let's give it a shot. All we can do is lose like we've done so many times before. Now what y'all working with? Look at them hiding. Ain't nobody out here. Oh, there they are. You think we can take these guys? I don't see any archers. Let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. Oh, they do have archers. And, uh... Uh-oh. This isn't going to win. My archers ran out into battle.
Let's not do that again. Okay, heal everybody up. That was just too close of a battle. Uh, we captured one territory. And we don't have a Titan to defend it. Which is not very smart. Yeah, we just tried this guy and we lost. Um, let's go and regroup. We can go to our arm, our barracks, and uh, we got two barracks. Let's let's try to uh, nothing. Troops capacity is at maximum. Can we upgrade it? No. And if we come here, we don't see any upgrade. If we go to level 1 barracks, we can't even upgrade our troops. Armory. Yeah, upgrade. to the other barracks. Enter. And go armory. There's no upgrade. But now that we've upgraded, what does that do for us? Are we able to add soldiers to different levels? Evidently not. Okay, let's go to the other barrack, enter, trying to add some people, can't do it. So we upgraded, for what reason? What does that do for us when we upgrade? Evidently nothing. Okay. There's a... Uh, there's no upgrading that. The Herald. That doesn't do anything for me. Let's just uh, put that there. Why? Just that there. Um, and uh, what is this? That's locked. A gold mine produces gold for your kingdom. Is it producing any gold for the kingdom? Storage is full? Oh my goodness. I have another gold mine over here, don't I? Let's go back and look. This is gold storage. And there's... It claims it's full. Well, yeah, we're over capacity. No, we're not. It's 11,300 plus 9,000 more. So why is it saying we're full? I hope the next update, if that is a flaw, that they fix that. Because, unless I'm reading it wrong, well, my barracks and... Where's my armor? Enter armory and everything's locked. Why? That's weird. It is locked. That's great. Castle. 
As your kingdom expands, you have unlocked the spell forge, food reserve, gold reserve. Okay. The spell forge allows you to craft spells. The food reserve and the gold reserve protect your resources from opponents. Magic is returning to the world. Spell the spell forge has been built. Wonderful. What do we want to do? Enter and craft spells to make yourself more powerful in battle. All right. That was easy. I think that's enough. And so they unlock some other spells for me. Um, yeah, that's probably all I'm gonna get. Um, what's going on here? I can't collect that. I don't have enough room in my deal. Okay, so I got a spell for it for updating my castle. Upgrading it. I can't upgrade it anymore. But I have two things happening with my buildings that I have not food reserved. What does that cost again? Uh, um, gold reserve. Okay, and we can hurry that up. <coughs> we got the food reserve. Reserve has finished construction. Yes, I see that. So you want me to upgrade it again? Alright. That's it, people. Everything else is locked. The Arcane Tower, what does that do? You can't even get any information on it yet. Medical school. I'm assuming that the other players that I've seen that are at 20 something and uh, 40 something um, thousand um, defense and all of that, they have hospital schools and all of that. And uh, yeah, I, I, I'm sure they do. Um, they're already there with this stuff. And I don't even know what this is for. What is this? For every builder's yard, you have one building can be constructed or upgraded. Well, it doesn't say that I can upgrade it. What is this? New, a new peril. Enter. 
a neighboring lord has entered our kingdom. He seeks an audience. My kingdom was destroyed by titans, and now they're hunting me down. You have to help. Well, I, I don't know how I can help you, buddy. These hunting titans hunting a mortal? It seems an unlikely story, but we should still be cautious. Cautious. Um, I agree. Let's dispatch a force to the border and see what we can find. Yeah? Bellic, uh telling us that we should do this. This guy is 5,000 in power. Uh, yeah, we, we don't want to raid the guy, I don't think. I'm not really sure. Yeah. His Titan is a lot stronger than mine. What's happening over here? I have not seen this territory until now. Did you open this territory up, Mr. Game? In hopes that we would uh, find it? And, uh, wow. So do I raid the guy or do I help him with this problem? I don't see the point in raiding if he's asking for help. Um, magic time. What would I be doing? Raiding your camp? Magic and melee. A little heat. 1500 I don't see where this is uh, wise to even get involved because the only option I see is to raid the band's camp and why would I want to do that uh, he seems like an innocent who just wants more of my help Am I reading this all wrong? Anybody in the comment section can tell me what I'm doing wrong? Well, guys, this is yet another stick, sticky situation. I think I'm going to have to investigate offline and see what I'm supposed to actually do here. Because the only option it looks like I have is to raid his kingdom, and that doesn't seem fair. And the guy just reached out to me for help. Uh, I'm not ruthless. But, uh, yeah. So I'm going to cut this video um, short here. This, this episode of um, Dawn of Titans. I hope you all enjoyed it. This is State of the Game online. Uh, State of the Game live stream, I should say. Um, check out our channel on YouTube um, this is the second episode of season one of Dawn of Titans and you can support our channel by liking us and subscribing to us and commenting on our videos um, with, if you will on YouTube Again, we are State of the Game live stream. That's the name of our channel. 
State of the Game live stream. You can. We're also on Patreon and Cash App. You can go to your nearest Android phone or devi other device or iOS device, and uh, you can download the Cash App. You can get it on either device, iOS or Android. Download the Cash App, and once you download it, you can uh, connect your information to it and. Uh, contribute to our, our gaming channel on there. Um, my handle on Cash App is dollar sign Q R U X. Dollar sign Q R U X. And I'm gonna end this video here. And um, until the next episode, thanks for coming out and, and hanging out with us. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Have a good one. Peace.